Question 39. Compound M is an important ingredient in perfume. Okay, because it says as the group. Okay, the M react with HCM. Which statement about these reactions are correct? So when this compound react with HCN, most likely we know uh, it's going to undergo nucleophilic addition. So we need to find the carbonyl group. So which is this one? And this one is ester group. It will not undergo nucleophilic addition. Okay, so let's uh, discuss uh, a very basic things about the mechanism. If there is a carbonyl groups, means the CO double bond, the cyanide will attack the carbonyl carbon, form a new bonding, CC bond. And the pi bonds in the carbonyl will break and these electrons will move to the oxygen to form this oxide. So this one is the intermediate and of course we not really care about what group is it here. And this oxide is going to get a proton from HCN and eventually is form OH. So it will form cyanohydrin at the end. And of course CH bond break, this pair of electrons move to carbon and it form regenerate the cyanide. Okay, so this one is a mechanism and we going to use this one right later. Okay, let's move on to the uh, part, the state, the first statement. A small amount of sodium hydroxide will speed up the reaction because in this reaction, is just the HCN with M. So when we add some sodium hydroxide in there, sodium hydroxide will react with HCN to form the sodium cyanide, NSCN. So and this one is the, it will form the cyanide ion. So therefore, it's true that when we add some sodium hydroxide, it can speed up the reaction because cyanide okay, will form later and it's going to use for the first step here. So this addition is going to be much faster with the presence of cyanide. Right, so therefore first statement is true, it's correct. Second statement, the reaction is initiated by the transfer of proton to one of the carbonyl group. Uh, only this carbonyl group will react, but it's not about proton, it's about cyanide ion. Right? So that's why second statement also wrong. Okay, last statement, both of the carbonyl groups react with HCN. Nope, it just this carbonyl group will react, this is ester group, so it will not react. Therefore, this statement also wrong. Answer is just D. Just the first statement. So it's D. That's all. Thank you.